Hey guys, Austin here, and welcome to another episode of Pixelmon vs. Mode here on the channel today. It has actually been a while since we've had an episode of this because you guys know last week we only had one video go out every day, and this video we didn't have this video go out today. So I mean, we're back, we're, we're back at it again with the Pixelmon vs. Mode. So to refresh your guys' memory, if you didn't see last episode, we actually lost to uh, Madara Uchiha. He destroyed us because apparently he's a Pokemon master, and now we're back to fighting uncommon people like that man back there but let's not talk about that let's talk about first off what pixelmon version we are using now i guys i said in my uh pixelmon survival series last friday that i might actually swap to the other pixelmon mod so if you guys don't know there's two mods currently in pixelmon there is pixelmon generations which is created by a complete separate team of people that were working on the original pixelmon dark mod i believe it was called and then they upgraded to pixelmon generations but as you guys know, it's been crashing and having a lot of lag issues for me. Well, it hasn't been crashing. It's just lagged to the point where the game will just freeze and then crash. So I decided to uh, swap out to the other Pixelmon version. If you don't know what that one is called, it is called um, Pixelmon Reforged, actually. And ironically, I said like a a few weeks ago that it was actually a, I was like, it's actually the bad version. Uh, they don't know what they're doing. Well, I was recently informed that it actually is the... Um, Hey, look, it's Mega Altaria. It is the uh, actual original Pixelmon developers working on it, so it's kind of ironic that I said that it was a bad, <laughs> it was a bad mod. But uh, we're, we're testing it out this week. This we're gonna see how it works. If there's absolutely no lag, you better believe we're using this one from now on. Um, the only difference is it doesn't have as many of the uh, Pokemon that were in Pixelmon Generations. It has the majority. So if I go to my Pokedex right now. If I just scroll through, where you see the numbers in question marks, that means the Pokemon exist. If you see, like, a dash, that means the Pokemon doesn't exist. So, looking at it, it seems pretty fair that the majority of the Pokemon exist. I didn't see a single one Mon that didn't exist yet. Um, I th just assume it has all the same ones. But I guess we'll find out today when we open our Pixelmon Lucky Blocks. So let's grab our stack of that and two stacks of Mask If you don't know how this series works, or if you're new to the channel, first off, welcome. I'm glad you uh, found this video in the... Uh, barrage of different YouTube's algorithm videos that pop up on your recommended screen but um if you found this one and you're brand new I welcome you to the channel I welcome you to the fam and uh, I ask you to stick around and maybe consider subscribing by the end of the video for all those of you who actually have been subscribed to me already I ask you just to try this video to 10 likes a simple goal and I think we can uh, accomplish it that being said uh it also came to my attention when I was asking you guys last week on which series you prefer. You guys did make a pretty good argument. A lot of you were, well not a lot of you, but a few of you were saying that you don't actually care for Pokemon and or never really were into it to begin with. So you didn't like the fact that I did like, what, three videos a week on Pokemon or I guess Pixelmon and Minecraft. And I completely understand that argument. Um, I would say think of it as though, I know this is literally Pokemon in Minecraft, but think of it as another mod in Minecraft. You don't have to know Pokemon to play this mod. Just treat it as like an ore spawn mod, uh, something that changes Minecraft completely in a different direction and makes you have to adapt to it. Um, that being said, if you don't enjoy Pokemon and or Pixelmon, I completely understand. Um, and just know I'm going to definitely work my schedule a little bit. So, we're not focusing primarily on Pokemon slash Pixelmon content the majority of the week. Because, what, three videos out of, what, ten? That's 30% of my content's Pixelmon. And if you guys don't like that, that's kind of a meh. So, we might try to dial it back to two videos of Pixelmon. That way, it's not too much of a burden on you guys who don't like it. And especially considering it's spaced out from uh monday wednesday and friday that's three days of the week like maybe what we could do is go back to our original schedule of having both po pixelmon videos in one day uh that might change things let me guys know about your uh suggestive things in the comments down below again i am formulating my schedule today on what i'm going to uh essentially oh look at the pikachu his model's kind of meh but i mean look at him i am going to be formulating my schedule this today actually so when this video goes live, comment down below what, what day of the week preferably you'd like to see my Pixelmon videos and or if you'd like to see me to keep it like the three videos a day or if you it, like my idea of dialing it back to two videos of Pixelmon a day. That being said, there'd be one Pixelmon versus mode and one um, of the modded survival series. That being said, let's actually get into this one. I know I've been talking a lot. I did that in my mod showcase earlier today too. 
Uh, which reminds me, I don't know if that video, I mean, this is me talking in the past to my future self. I don't know if uh, that video uploaded at 3 at three o'clock p.m. like it should have. If it uploaded a little bit later, just know that's because, like, since I'm recording my videos now in real time every day, I can't preset a time. It's kind of like I record it and then hope I can upload by 3 and or, well, this video would go up at 5. Normally, the 5 o'clock one should go up at the right time. Unless I'm literally swamped that day. So don't expect a crisp 3 and 5 p.m. upload schedule like it's been. If it's a little bit off, then I apologize. There should never be a video going up earlier than those times. Unless, like, I specifically say there will be. But, uh, just know if I, uh, mess up or... Oh, we got this thing right away. Okay, I'll take the pseudo-legendaries. Thank you. Um, but yeah, just know if, uh, if I mess up one way or another... That, then uh, it, it's just because I wasn't able to get the video out in time and I apologize in advance. That being said, I mean, it's the first day of the summer. We got to get our, our schedules down. And considering I'm not sensing any lag, I'm starting to think this might be the uh, version we want to go with. And you guys are probably thinking, well, there's rarely any lag on the, pre on the other version. Why are you swapping? Well, so I don't say it too much, but like if there's ever like slight lag, I don't mention it. I kind of just deal with it. Oh my. Come here, everything that's worth things to me um oh and so we're fighting the equal boss today i forgot to mention he will be the uh, same level as my highest pokemon so we can kind of actually mess around today with what pokemon we want to do and when i'm actually going to grab these because for the move relearner uh and if you guys are curious about how i go about doing things on this series just read the uh description of the video i think i have rules posted somewhere on how i do the series in case you guys are just curious at any point in time on what I'm doing or what I'm going for. Uh, one more thing. I was unable to, you probably could already tell because of the flower drop and the tool drop. I was unable to edit the config file yet, unfortunately. So uh, I'll definitely get to doing that today as well. All I do ask is, um, I forget who it was that posted the list beforehand. But uh, if you could post that, uh, that command list again that has all the uh, mega stones. Like the one that lets you uh, add the Mega Stones into the the Pixmon drop thing. Um, I very much appreciate it. If you can't, then that's understandable as well. I'll just look through the comments to find it again. But for some reason, I lost it. I don't know what happened to that list, but I lost it somehow. Uh, so yeah, if you're if you're watching this video and you still have that list handy, feel free to uh, post it in the comments and I will grab it. And that is a level two Kofagrigus. That was a very weak Mon right there, but I'll take it. Uh, hello there. Ooh, Cradley. And I always make the comment, every single time I change up the version, we get new drops from the uh, the Pixmon Lucky Block, and I'll never understand that. Oh, Luke Cola, hello. But as you're probably realizing, most of the models are the exact same. There are actually a few newer models, it seems. Um, I am not going to review this mod, however, just like, under, it, tank under the assumption it's the same as the previous one. And besides, that would kind of be a wasted video of me just reviewing that. Ooh, Yuxi! It would kind of just be a wasted video of me reviewing the exact same mod again, essentially. And Nidoran, you want to fight? Shadow Claw, I upgraded my Giratina's moves. What are you going to do about it? Um, oh, two duds in a row. All right. <laughs> Three duds. Giant Tauros. Oh, my. Oh, Dra uh, Dragonair. Oh, hello there, Reshiram. Sorry, I can't use you today. You're level 70. Me Blastoise! <laughs> oh, what is this? Moo Moo Milk? I have never gotten that drop out of the Pixelmon Lucky Block. Alright. Uh, enchantment Table. I'll count that as a rare item. Why not? The Barnacle Man himself. A Mudkip with a different color texture. Same with Skitty. Okay. Interesting. Just master Ball, you guys, real quick. And also, just know if I do swap the to. From, well, I probably am going to do it, but if I do use this version on the uh, our Pixel Mod series, it shouldn't change anything, I don't think. I mean, I swapped it on here to test it and it didn't change anything. I don't think so. If I do lose a single Pokemon, I'll just spawn it back in for myself, but I think we should be good. Is this King we're trying to... I know he spawned in, but I'm just going to catch him just so he gets out of my way. Actually, wait, did I never catch this Dragonair? What the heck? There we go. Okay, well now that we've caught everything, now we move on to the step of us uh, sorting through all our mods and seeing who we want to actually use. Of course, Giratina is off limits. So, I'm actually thinking let's have Yuxi as our final Pokemon, because I don't want to use Legendaries today. 
Uh, you guys have openly said that you like it whenever I swap between them. So let's just go for level 50s or high level 45s. Let's go with that. So you guys are actually all too high of level then, me saying that. So let me just let me just see what we can get. That's level 50. You're level 55. You're level 49, so I can grab you. Uh, any more level 50s? Level 50s. Level 50s. Level 50s. Okay, so you're 48, so I'll grab you. But I think that's what our team is going to be looking like. I'm going to end with you, because like I said, who do we want to lead off with? Let's lead off with the weakest one, Proba Pass, and then go in. Uh, no, I kind of want to lead off strong. Let's lead off with Barnacle Man, because I never use him. Like, ever. <laughs> you probably can understand. I don't even know his proper name. And now that we have this, who do we have for TMs? We have Thunder. Can I teach this to Barnacle Man? Nope. Let's just keep going down and see who we can teach Thunder to. Be cool if, Oh, I was going to say, could Haunter learn Thunder? That'd be cool. He can't, actually, so give that to him. And then we have Explosion. Can Barnacle Man learn this? I was going to say... I was going to say, why am I not surprised we could? Um... Oh, you can learn Explosion too? Haunter, you're just getting all the TMs. Okay, so now the Moon Milk will keep for X or HP rising. Same with the Max Potions. But we do have three items to give to the uh, Movery Learner as offerings. And now we can give moves to Pokemon. So you see, let me just make sure he's got a move. Let me just make sure he has extra sensory. Just so he's not going to a fight and, like, not fighting. Um, Blastoise, let's make sure you have a good move. Flash Cannon, let's give it to him. Alrighty. And finally, Barnacle Boy. Oh, wow, I didn't realize you could learn so many moves. Um, Skull Bash, but it's normal. Let's go with Stone Edge. Uh, yeah, Shell Smash, get rid of that. Oh, he does no Shell Smash, but I mean, getting rid of it. Eh. Alright, let's move in. We're fighting against Goku today. Goku Super Saiyan Blue. Let's do it. 3, 2, 1. Let's go. And we're stuck in the screen. Great. All right, he's got a Togetic. Togetic. Oh boy, I'm already thinking about how I can lose to this thing. Slash. So that's a Whale Lord. Oh boy, we got a Whale Lord on on patrol here. Uh, if it's Whale Lord, then let's just go with Home Claws. Oh, that that that's not an attack move. Oops, my B. All right. Hopefully, if I can survive this, no, use Brine. My brain. I know it's not the same move, but it's fine. Okay, Ludicolo, use Ludicolo. Giga Drain, please. Swaps out to... Of course he has a Reshiram. Of course he has a Reshiram. Ludicolo! A... How do I beat Reshiram? Oh, no. This is actually bad. Oh, no. Reshiram, why? Haunter, you're up. Sucker Punch. Oof. Oof. Okay, Blastoise, you're up. Oh, it is fire type. Use Water Pulse. Oh, that did nothing. Aqua Tail? Okay, Aqua Tail did damage. But I'm going to die because it's too late. No, Pro Pass, you're up. Crap. Ooh, he swaps out to a Palpatoad. Okay. Pro Pass, you got this. He also knows Rest, Pro Pass. He keeps using supersonic on me, but I'm just destroying him. Up, swap, swap up, help to star me. Are you just gonna keep swapping? Oh, he can recover. I mean, are we really gonna play the recover game here, star me? I'm eventually gonna do enough damage to kill you. He's gonna use recover right now. No, he swaps out again to. I forget this Pokemon's name. Wait a minute. Let me read its name Luminion. Yeah, all this Pokemon are getting damaged by my Pro Pass right now. Like, is he. Uh, like, what is he trying to do here? Wow, it's still alive. You've got to be kidding me. Um, wow. His Luminion is still alive. Yuxi. Extra Sensory. He swapped out to Reshiram. I knew he was going to do that, but I destroyed it. Yeah. All right, Starmie, you're up. Let's hit him with the... Let's hit him with a Future Sight, actually. Yeah, that's right. Use Recover. Let me hit... Use that Future Sight. Recover all your way up. Uh, we'll go with Confusion now, also. Wasn't very effective. Future Sight should have also hit. Yeah, let's go up with another Future Sight. And Starmie is just going to be that guy and just keep recovering. But he only should have 10 to recover, if I'm correct. Yeah, he should only be able to do this 10 times. So I'm just going to give you a little more confusion until he's confused enough. 
that it actually uh, does its thing. So the funny thing is, Starmie's Psychic type, I'm pretty sure. So, <laughs> it's literally just me not being super effective to him. Ooh, actually, there's that. Oh, he swaps out to Togetic. What's with you swapping out so much? Alright, well, given the future sight. Oh no, Yuxi's confused. Yuxi's confused. Bag, HP, max potion, heal. Metric. The sleep powder. You've gotta be kidding me, and I dodged it. That's hilarious. Alright, Togetic's gone. Luminion's up. Uh, I'll just hit with confusion cookies. Yeah. Whale Lord, though. Okay, I'm just gonna ahead of time do a future sight just to be sure that I kill the next Pokemon. So, Whale Lord's out. Yeah. Starmie is up. We'll hit him with a confusion. Alrighty. Palpatode should be hit with future sight. Yep, future sight destroyed. No, actually, he didn't, but I did level up. Yuxi is now level 51. But so is his Pokemon, so technically he all leveled up. Is that it? We did it! We won the battle! Go, Yuxi! Come out here! My little Yuxi destroyed them. But I am probably not going to put Yuxi in the thumbnail because I didn't want this to be a legendary battle today. So I'm going to probably put Probo Pass, I'd say, because he did the most. But guys, we defeated Super Saiyan Blue Goku, but we can't defeat Madara Uchiha. Of course, I mean, obviously Madara is stronger than Yuxi, am I right? Or Madara is stronger than Goku, that's what I was trying to say here. But guys, if you did enjoy today's video, hit that like button. Try to this video to 10 likes. Also, if you are new, I hope you subscribed because we do amazing modded content like this every single day of the week here on the channel. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.